Alright guys, welcome back. Sorry for the long wait, but I got a little package from uh, Tuck Warehouse. This is to be exact fifty dollars about fifty dollars and I'll show you kind of what I got. I just got stuff to start me off for the spring. I will be buying another thing for the summer, but hello? No. This kid. Alright, before I get before I get interrupted again, I'm gonna show you this box that I got. I got a New Tech Finesse Jig in PB&J color. I'm pulling out of these. I, New Tech Jigs are, I think, I don't want to say they're number one, but they're one of the best. And the reason why is because no matter how they land, they're always going to land straight up like this. These jigs always land upright, and it's got the double weed guard right here. The hooks are sticky sharp. I got a Finesse PB&J one. I got a black and blue finesse new tech jig. I got all I got new tech jigs this time. Got a black and blue football headed jig. Black and blue is good all around, and I'll need to get some trailers for them. Also got another PB and J, and uh, the PB and J is for uh, like clean water or uh, not dirty water or murky water. Just more yeah clear water and then the black and blues for dirty water or just a good all around i got some early summer stuff to test out i got some must add denny bauer grip pin uh heavy uh, heavy punching hooks these ones have a really good hook keeper on them and then i got a miller punching weight and if you don't know what miller punching weight is let me pull it up for you Pretty much, unlike your normal weights, you don't have to cast it super sky high or anything. You can like pitch it over there, and it'll it'll fall down through this way, and it'll go straight in, and with the, it'll punch, it'll blah, like it's, like they call it the punching ray. They'll punch through, and they go down there. And tungsten's more dense than lead, so a one ounce lead would be probably two to three times the size of this. So I got that. This was pretty expensive. This was a ten dollar uh, a ten dollar. Uh, tungsten way it's pretty expensive for me a tenth and sixth ounce finesse finesse shrooms and these they're the net they're for the ned rigs and everything I, they got them in just black and then i got black and blue finesse trds Hold up right here little tiny things smell pretty good and all this will do is it'll sit on the ground and it'll just be like this and you just drag it and drag it this is for this will work in the winter too. I, hopefully this is going to be probably the last unboxing in a row. I'll hopefully be able to go and do fishing or something like that. So I got black and blue flake. And then I got new money which is kind of a little bit brighter than a, I don't know, a green pumpkin. I just kind of liked it. Kind of like the color of it and everything. And last but not least, I will put this on as soon as I'm done with the video. I got, I'm trying a new kind of line. I, I've used Power Pro before. And Power Pro, well, for braid, Power Pro works good, but it, like the color will will fade off in there and everything. Otherwise, it's really strong. And I tried Spider Wire last year and wasn't really impressed with the Spider Wire, knowing that right after I was done frogging for the first time, the next day the line was already starting to fade. And faded line is really annoying. I'll show you some right now. So your braid should not look like this. I know this is really old, but it looks just like this right after I was done. That's how you know the braid isn't very quality. It isn't very high quality. So I got, I'm gonna try Sunline this year. I got Sunline model fluorocarbon. This was on sale and it was only 110 yards and that's all I needed for my uh, bait casting reel for now. I will be getting some uh, FX2 flipping, frogging and flipping in the 50 pound with my uh, combo. I will show you a little sneak peek of my combo about now. But pretty much this the Daiwa Laguna, it's exactly what you need for the reel. It's a little bit heavier duty. It's a 7 to 1, one 7 to 1 gear ratio. That's plenty fast. That's fast enough. And then I got a Daiwa Arid X casting reel and heavy. I kind of wanted I kind of want heavy because I will use it for flipping, but for frogging that way I can yank them out of the out of that uh, heavier cover. Which there's not too much heavier cover, but it's just nice because. Up at Dewey where I caught my personal best, we plan on going up there in May and 
when they get wrapped around those reeds, it is impossible to get them out. I lost several fish because they got tangled around the reeds. This will be up Friday, this video you're watching right now, and then hopefully Saturday, I will have a fishing video if all goes well. And then I will be doing some testing for new GoPro footage. I'm going to be trying to do some John B edits, aka B-roll. If you don't know what B-roll is, I'll show you a little clip right now. There's your bull. Oh, so we gotta go on our knees now. We gotta go on He makes a really good channel. I'll link him down in the description and everything and give him all credit. I just want to show you that little, that's what B-roll pretty much looks like and everything. I'm gonna try to do a couple little things like that because on our big trip up to Merritt and everything, I plan on doing pretty much make it look like a movie for fishing. Sounds kind of weird, but I don't know how to explain and everything. That's kind of what I want to try to do. But that's the unboxing. Thanks for watching and see you next time, hopefully with a fishing video. If not, we'll have a lucky tackle box unboxing like usual, but I'll try to do it like outside or somewhere else because it gets kind of boring doing it in my room. I mean, my room's a mess right now. I feel like cleaning it right now either. I'm, I'm going to bed right after, right after I'm done editing, so see ya. I could die, been on the rise. Look in my eyes, ask, ask me if I ever reminisce about when we were together I say goodbye, been on a grind, like I've been working forever A time that I shine, baddie from down south, so I fly in every month to show that baddie north of Miami, she's mine White jeans with the vans on, girls just can't wait to get her hands on 18 years old when I made a blueprint, 21 right now, got a plan on lock All this it breaks while I work the same, happy as fuck made it out through the pain Seeing these artists change races, I say this ain't artists in person